Kendrick, president of the Negro Leagues Baseball Museum, and welcome to this moment in Negro Leagues Baseball history. Leroy Satchel Page, arguably the greatest pitcher the sport has ever seen. We know for certain the oldest rookie in the history of Major League Baseball. Major League Baseball says that Page was 42 years old when he finally got his opportunity to play for the Cleveland Indians in 1948 as a rookie. Cleveland would win the World Series. Many thought Satchel Paige should be named Rookie of the Year. Satchel Paige was likely closer to 52 than 42. Never told his real name, but whether it was 42 or 52, his feats were legendary. The clock is fastball at 105 miles per hour in his prime. But what really made him so special was the pinpoint control. He could throw it exactly where he wanted to throw it, and even as an old man, he never lost that ability, not to just throw strikes, but to put it exactly where he needed to. Satchel Paige never warmed up using home plate. He would use a stick of chewing gum wrapper. And wherever the catcher moved the chewing gum wrapper, Satchel right over the top of that chewing gum wrapper. And as Paige would whimsically say, he broke both corners of that chewing gum wrapper. Satchel Paige's legendary feat uh, documented here at the Negro Leagues Baseball Museum. Satchel Paige was inducted into the National Baseball Hall of Fame in 1971, the first Negro Leagues player to earn that honor. Satchel Paige, someone you should know. This historical moment was brought to you by the Negro League Baseball Museum located in Kansas City, Missouri and in association with Cascade Media Group. <laughs>